He is known for his successful personal appearance publicity tour across the United States and Canada in 1917. He is also recognized for a controversial statement about not joining the war that caused a significant decline in his popularity. His name is J. Warren Kerrigan. In the early 20th century, a rising star captivated audiences with his charismatic presence and dynamic acting skills. J. Warren Kerrigan, born on July 25, 1879, grew up in Boston, Massachusetts. His passion for the entertainment industry blossomed at a young age, leading him to pursue a career in acting. Kerrigan's journey to stardom began in 1912 when he joined the burgeoning film industry in California. He quickly gained recognition for his captivating performances, becoming a sought-after leading man. His talent and on-screen charisma propelled him to the height of his career, starring in numerous silent films throughout the 1910s. However, Kerrigan's popularity took an unexpected turn during a publicity tour in May 1917. A reporter from the Denver Times asked him if he would be joining the war effort. To the shock of his fans and the press, Kerrigan replied in the affirmative. This statement reverberated across the country, causing his popularity to plummet. Some attributed the decline to his living arrangements, as he resided with his mother and partner James Vincent in the same house, without a business manager to handle the negative publicity. Despite the setback, Kerrigan's impact on the film industry cannot be denied. His contributions to silent cinema paved the way for future actors and actresses. Although his popularity never fully recovered after his war statement, J. Warren Kerrigan remains a prominent figure in the history of early Hollywood, showcasing the trials and tribulations that can come with fame. James Carroll Vincent, a silent movie actor, had an unconventional personal life that often intrigued the public. Born in Baltimore, Maryland, he made the journey to California to pursue his acting dreams. It was in California that Vincent crossed paths with another actor, J. Warren Kerrigan, and their lives would become intertwined. Vincent eventually moved into Kerrigan's home in Los Angeles, at 2307, Cahuenga Boulevard, and they began a long-term relationship. Despite being identified as Kerrigan's secretary or gardener at different times, Vincent was much more than that. In the world of silent movies, he made his mark as a juvenile actor, appearing in films such as Out of Court in 1919, The Coast of Opportunity in 1920, and $30,000 in 1924. These movies often featured Kerrigan himself, indicating the closeness of their professional and personal lives. However, their story took a tragic turn in 1924 when an automobile accident occurred in Dixon, Illinois, while they were traveling from Sterling to Chicago. News reports at the time named Vincent as Kerrigan's secretary, highlighting their connection even in the midst of a traumatic event. Nevertheless, they persevered through this ordeal and continued their life together. Sadly, their relationship came to an end with Kerrigan's death on June 9, 1947. Kerrigan, at the age of 67, succumbed to pneumonia. He was laid to rest at Forest Lawn Memorial Park in Glendale, California, leaving behind a legacy in the world of silent films. Devastated by the loss of his partner, Vincent's life took a tragic turn. Just nine months after Kerrigan's passing, on March 15, 1948, Vincent took his own life by gas in his bedroom at 14716 Magnolia Boulevard in Van Nuys, California. The weight of grief may have been too much to bear for Vincent. He, too, was laid to rest at Forest Lawn Memorial Park, beside his beloved Kerrigan. The personal life and untimely deaths of James Carroll Vincent and J. Warren Kerrigan remain a poignant reminder of the complexities and fragilities of human existence. Their love story, marked by success, tragedy, and ultimate sorrow, continues to captivate those who discover their legacy in the annals of silent film history. Do you want to explore more actors? Who do you want to see featured next? Subscribe and leave a comment below to let me know. I'll see you in the next video.